Yes then guys, how are we all doing? My name's Morsi and welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I'm about to complete an SBC. That SBC is for the first Bundesliga Player of the Month in FIFA 22. It's a man who's close to my heart. It's Florian Wirtz, the boy who had the sickest silver star last year. He had a path to glory silver star. Didn't get the upgrade because Germany flopped in the Euros. It is what it is. But this time round, 86 overall. He has been super juiced. To unlock this man, it's an 85 and an 84 overall team. And he's going to walk out for us. We're getting spoiled. We're getting fully treated to the Florian Burt show. They have actually changed the walkout animations as well, guys. So I think there's a little delay on the player actually walking out now. You kind of get a sweat a little bit longer. But I've not looked at the man's attributes. All I saw was the name. I saw the face card. And I knew I had to get him in my team. But what are we working with? Four star, four star, happy days, high medium, five foot nine. Fantastic skill moves and weak foot. We're looking good so far. In regards to attributes, the pace is a little bit on the lower side, but the acceleration hopefully will carry the card. Shooting going forward, he should be somewhat clinical. Incredible passing stats. The dribbling's fantastic. Wow. 91 dribbling, 89 ball control, 91 agility, 87 balance. 93 stamina as well on the card. It should be up and down all damn game, which we love to see. In regards to traits, we've got outside the foot shot, flare trait, and a whole host of CPU AI traits. So the card looks insane. I cannot wait to get into this player view. So let's waste no time and go meet the boys he's going to be rocking with. I have bought in Diaby purely to get full chem on Verts for this player view. In my actual team, I'll probably use Kingsley Coman there and play Verts on 8 chemistry. But we want to test him out to the best of his abilities, so we made sure he's on 10 for that. So the rest of the team, we've got Neuer in goal, and Babu, Lacroix, Upamecano and Davies. The budget Vieira, Frankie de Jong, Dembele. we got the rat himself, Ben Yede, who I've actually yet to use this year. So fingers crossed he feels decent on the ball. I'm sure he will do. 21.25k, he cost me. A little bit expensive and 84 overall but his stats look pretty crazy and then obviously Diaby to fill in that chemistry slot. Heading over to custom tactics we're rocking balance defensive 50-50, balance forward runs 50 on the whip, 6 in the box, 2 from corners and 3 kicks. Formations are 4-3-2-1, Ben Yedder is our striker, then Bele Diaby either side, the Young, Tuameni and Verts in the midfield 3 and the back 4 stays the same. So what we're doing with Verts here is we're going to get him on stay forward and cover centre. I want him almost as a cam in that midfield three. I want him bombing up and down the pitch. His stamina is fantastic. He should be able to keep up with the game. And we're going to utilise his attacking attributes a lot during this gameplay. I can't wait anymore, boys. I'm insanely excited to try this man out. Hopefully he gets a sick dynamic image. In the past, I believe all they've got is them just holding that like Bundesliga trophy. Uh, but fingers crossed he gets hooked up this time around. But let's go into Division 2. Sweat our balls off a little bit and test out Florian Verts. So at the time of recording this, I'm still waiting for my tripod to arrive. So I'm very much forehead cam nip muck style at the moment. But my opponent's team's pretty sick. It looks sweaty as expected in Div 2. But if I kind of lose focus and you see me kind of like this, guys, just go with the flow of it, right? It is what it is. I will have it sorted soon. But come on, Florian. Where are you, you beauty? Here he is. How we feeling on the ball? Oh, mate. Close control dribbling. We're looking good, boys. We're looking good. His dribbling feels fantastic. He's literally dancing around Varane and Mendy. Oh, mate. This card. I've got seriously high hopes here. Carry that ball up against Renato Sanchez. He's not the best centre midfielder this year, but he's still very, very overpowered. Beautiful run. Musa Diaby. Musa Diaby with the goal. The man is about 15 shooting. His finishing's in the bin. But I remember his, was it, oh, it wasn't on my screen. What was it? Rule Breakers last year. I used them as a super sub throughout the early, uh, early months of FIFA 21. And he was incredible. Uh, and he's turning up here. Oh, the interception. Read him like a book and we move, boys. We've got a lot of pace, this team. Having Diaby and Dembele either side of Ben Yedda, there are some pacey old boys out there. Just once you get in front of goal, you're not always going to be reliable. Oh, hello. Hello. Soccer AM skill show. What are we saying? What the showboat? Come on up, boys. Let's get that second goal. I would love a debut goal for Florian. Left foot finesse there. Sit for Rand's big back, innit? We are defending strong, like absolute gladiators at the back, but it is a non stop barrage of free kicks, finesse shots, and all you name it, my opponent's throwing at me. But come on up, boys. Let's get it down and let's go. Dabby over the top. Dabby made that. Gotta be. Mate, this card. This card this year, you don't need shooting stats. All you need is a bit of Dabby magic and he bags them. To so 2-0 up at halftime, feeling good so far. Vert's first impressions. I'm happy with the card. He feels good. He doesn't seem so quick on the ball, but the close control dribbling you would have seen early on in that game 
ridiculous. If you're decent with the left stick or the right bumper dribbling, you're going to have a good laugh with Florian Wirtz. And that'll be for the strong link. The man's got two goals in Div 2. Looking for that overlap, Florian. Up against Kimpembe. It's not a man you want to be up against. We're going for him. Oh, ref. He's took my Achilles. Takes the book in. What are we saying free, key, uh, free kick stat-wise for Florian? Yeah, not a lot going on. Not a lot going on for the man. We're going to try to dink this back post, I think. Is that Dabby at the back post for the hat-trick? He's not getting he's not scored from there, is he? Oh, Frankie de Jong. Underrated. You know how else is underrated? Oh, ref. He's off. He's off. I knew it. You can't be swiping Achilles like that chap and get away with it. Big finesse. Florian. Kaylor Navas is there. Oh, it's Chua Meni gets the red card. That man's a bit of a beast as well. We're happy to see him gone. Come on now, boys. 2-0 up. Ponis down to 10 men. There's no way I fluff my lines here, surely. We're not going to get that chance of Florian because my opponent has quit. 2 0 win, though. We take those. We have to go again. We need a goal with Florian Verts. That is the aim of this player view. So, on to game number two. So, game number two, that is a stacked team. Everybody is rocking that Carl Walker, Marquinhos, Kimpembe, and Mendy back four. That is what I've noticed so far in the high divisions. And the rest of the team's pretty uh, stacked as well. So we may have a game on our hands. But can we make it two for two? Could Derby step up again? Can we get that goal with Verts? Oh, rig. Over the top, Florian. What a ping, Ben Yedda. The dink. We go again. We get lucky. Oh, we get super lucky. That goal was suspect. But the pass from uh, Florian Verts on a plate for Wissam Ben Yedda. We won't talk about the finish, but it's a goal nevertheless, boys, and we find ourselves 1-0 up. Ooh, what a ping. Davies, take this down. Kipembe's chasing him down. That's a pick out. Chua Meni probably should have taken a little bit more time. Composed myself a little bit and picked my corner. But decent bit of play. Florian Verts again, pinging passes for fun. Lovely bit of play from the boys. Dabby's in space. Low driven. The man has scored another. Three goals in two games for the man with probably some of the worst shooting stats you'll see for a forward player this year. We'll take it. Oh, we might be in trouble. Sancho's in and Sancho scores. Is it Jesus scores? It's the first time shooting. I've noticed a lot of people doing that a lot more now. Is that the new way to bag goals, boys? I need to stay up with the trend of things here. So 2-1 lead at half time, guys. My opponent is quite literally throwing the kitchen sink at me. Every one of his players is pretty much in my goal mouth for the past like 15 in-game minutes. So we've got to stay strong, break the press. That is where Florian's going to be vital, picking passes. And we've got to be clinical when we get our chances. It's a lyrical genius up in here. Lovely overlap. Lovely. Keep going, Florian. Little one across. Pembe's there again. That man, honestly, must be on some sort of steroids. There it is. My opponent gets the goal. It has been relentless. Non-stop pressure. Releasing Florian. Up against Kim Pembe again. <laughs> There's only going to be one winner and it's not going to be me. Just hold the ball up a little bit. Where are the options? Then Babu, not quite what we had in mind, but we go. A little give and go, lovely. Little one over. Sterling. Florian. Florian. He's only got to done it, boys. The man on his second game for the boys. Steps up. Looked questionable. Thought he was going to fluff his chance a little bit. But the questionable touch was all on purpose, guys. And he finds the back of the net. He gets the goal in the player view. We're happy. And we've got the 3-2 lead. Ah, oh, Florian. Naughty. Oh, the space. Diaz through the middle. <laughs> I'm not complaining. That's GG's 4-2 win on purpose. We meant to do that. We meant to take the deflection into Wissam Ben Yedda. So that's back-to-back -back wins for me, and that puts me a step closer to Division 2 rank 1. But Florian Verts, are you worth it? I believe currently as it stands, 60 to 70k is the cost to get the 84 and 85 squad done. 100% worth it. This guy is sensational. 
The way he controls the ball and carries the ball at his feet is beautiful. It is practically glued to his boots, which is great to see. The pace, a chem style maybe to boost that up might be needed. There was a couple of moments where I felt like he wasn't necessarily you know, beating past the midfield press like Renato Sanchez and Kante. They kept up with him quite easily. But the passing, the through balls are brilliant. Overall, I was just the joy of a card, man. The stamina didn't stop going all damn game, up and down the pitch, playing in that kind of like attacking midfield free roll. Beautiful card. Anyway, guys, that's my going on this one. I hope you enjoyed as always. If you did, please drop me a like on the video. Leave me a comment. Let me know if you're going to lock flow inverts yourself. And I'll catch you very soon for another one. Take it easy.